Hello, I'm Tomasz from Polygon Flow. In this video, I will compare importing an asset into Unreal with and without Dash. As an example, I'm using a model from the Polyhaven library, but the import process will be more or less the same for other third-party asset libraries. So, let's take a look at how we can import a model into Unreal Engine 5 using the classic method. I will download a model from the Polyhaven website. I use the search bar to find what I'm looking for. I want to download this tire model. I select the file format and the texture resolution, then click the download button. To give you an idea of how long the import takes, I'm going to start a timer. I have sped up the video, but in real life more than 6 minutes passed since I downloaded the model. We can import Polyhaven assets into Unreal more easily using Dash. Open the Dash content library. As you can see, several asset libraries are instantly available, such as the Megascans library, the IES library and the Polyhaven library. Polyhaven is one of the first libraries to integrate with Dash, but we are working on onboarding more. Not only models, but also HDRI maps and materials can be easily imported. Let's find our model. There it is. I can immediately choose the texture resolution I want to download the asset with. I choose 4K. You can search for assets in different ways, like clicking on the Find Similar. You don't need to know the exact name of the model. With the AI tagging system, Dash automatically adds tags for the assets. Simply drag and drop an asset into the scene. The asset appears instantly with the correct material. As you can see, with Dash it only took one second to import the model from the asset library. I can easily adjust the material using Dash. On top of that, I can combine the import with Dash's physics paint tool and easily scatter the assets into the scene. Or I can scatter the model directly on the surface, straight from the content library. As you can see, with Dash you can set up a scene in no time compared to the usual import process. I hope you find this video useful and if you like Dash, you can try it now for free. Take care, bye bye.